Hey, what's going on everybody? This is Mike with Wu Audio. Today's episode of Frequently Asked Questions, we're going to talk about impedance versus sensitivity on headphones. Customers have said to us that they have high impedance headphones and now they need a high power amplifier to drive them. Now this is not always the case because high impedance doesn't necessarily mean power demanding. We also need to look at a measurement called sensitivity or the SPL rating. Here's an example. The Sennheiser HD600 and the HD650 are both rated at 300 ohms, but the sensitivity of the 600 is only 97 dB, while the 650 is at 103 dB. So if you're driving these two headphones through an amplifier, the HD650 will play louder than the HD600, but if you have a low impedance headphone, it doesn't mean that it's going to be easy to drive. Here's an example, the Diana 5 by Abyss. It is rated at 32 ohms, but the sensitivity is only at 91 dB. So this is actually going to be significantly more difficult to drive than the HD600. On paper, the 6 dB doesn't seem to be a lot, but for the amplifier to reach a 6 dB difference, it needs to triple its power. So at the sensitivity rating of 91 dB at 1 watt, the Diana 5 will need 2 watts of power to reach 94 dB, and 3 watts of power to reach 97 dB just to match the Sennheiser HD600's 1 watt 97 dB sensitivity. And that is why sensitivity is more important than the impedance. We hope this short video helped you select the right headphone for your amplifier. And if you like this video, give us a thumbs up and subscribe, and tell your friends about us. If you have a question specific to your Wu Audio system, send us an email and we'll try our best to answer it. And if you have a topic that you'd like us to cover in an upcoming FAQ video, send us an email with the subject line FAQ videos. Thanks for watching and we'll see everyone in our next video.